you very much. <laughs> now it's time to go over to Slops and Dining at the Dining yeah! today. We have Gareth Reese Roberts with his dad, Stephen. <laughs> and apparently, when he tries to take his son to the swimming pool, he doesn't, he takes him to the footy. That sounds Ooh! quite like a good deal to me. Yeah, so let's go to the man that's buddy. mad. He's swell. He's the king of hair gel. Yeah! And he's the guy who delivers this. And welcome back to Slobs, the slobbiest diner in town. Our diner of the day is Steve Roberts, and he's been brought here by his son, Gaz. Steve's gone for today's special, the Sloppy Burger. And now it's time for the game. Steve, I'm going to ask you three questions. If you get just one wrong, you'll be sloppy burgered. However, if you get all three right, we do a slop swap, and Gaz will get sloppy burgered. OK, first question. You can forecast the weather with a stick of celery or some Scunthorpe seaweed. S Scunthorpe seaweed. Scunthorpe seaweed. OK, next question. Were false teeth originally made of broken porcelain figurines or hippopotamus bones? Hippopotamus bones. Hippopotamus bones. OK, and the final question. What lasts longer, a can of my hairspray or a bottle of synth's perfume? Synth's perfume. Since perfume. OK, it's now the big moment. Drum roll, please. Because, Steve, I asked you three questions, you gave me three fantastic answers, and I'm very happy to tell you, you got one wrong. Take it away. <laughs> That'll teach you not to take gas swimming, won't it? Right, let's find out the answers to those questions. I ask you, you can forecast the weather with a stick of celery or some Scunthorpe seaweed. And the answer is some Scunthorpe seaweed. Well done, you got that one right. I then asked, were false teeth originally made of broken porcelain figurines or hippopotamus bones? And the answer is... Hippopotamus bones. Well done. You got that one right. And finally, I asked, what lasts longer, a can of my hairspray or a bottle of Synth's perfume? And the answer is... Neither, cos I use gel and she uses air freshener. So bad luck. You got that one wrong as well. Have you enjoyed your meal? Lovely. Well, I've got a very special prize for you. It is the Golden Slop Dog. Thank you very much, Ambrose. And there it is. And Gaz, did you enjoy your dad's meal? Brilliant. Brilliant. Well, we've got a very special prize for you as well. It is the sloppy doggy bag, complete with a baseball cap and T-shirt. But you also get to deliver the ultimate takeaway. Take it away, Gaz! <laughs> well, thanks for dropping into Slops. I hope you've enjoyed yourself. But remember, we might be delivering a takeaway to you. Ciao. Get out. Holding shot on camera one, Nick. You're making a film and it's set